Obviously, if you've got a lot of data that's stored in a different location or on another system, you won't want to be importing them one at a time manually. So we have got um, a way of bulk importing all of the data in one go. So if you go to the menu and go to settings and go to data, this is where you'll find all of the options here. Uh, we've got some inbuilt importers for a few systems for um, George, a worker, cleaner planner and smart round. So if you just go into one of those, you just attach the files um, in there and that'll come through as a support ticket to our support team who will run the import for you and be in contact via your email. Um, alternatively, um, if you've got your data stored on like an Excel file or something like that, um, you can either do this yourself by going to the sample squeegee import CSV file and pop in the data onto that form in the correct format, which I'll show you in just a moment. Or you can go to this section here because we offer um, an import service as well, which we charge for, but we just charge for our time in um, converting the file to the correct format. Attach your files there and we'll take a look at it and give you a quick quote on how long we think that's going to be and therefore how much it's going to cost. Um, if I move over now to um, the sample squeegee CSV import file, um, it's pretty straightforward. Um, there's a fair bit of copying and pasting that you've got to do to get all of your customers in, your customer addresses, etc. But just a couple of things to note if you're going to do it yourself in this format is the customer phone numbers. If you're copying and pasting numbers that start with a zero, um, and if you're using any kind of program like Excel or um, Google Sheets or anything like that, you need to make sure that you've got though that um, particular row saved as text rather than numbers. Otherwise, it will remove all of those initial zeros and none of your SMSs will work. Alternatively, you can have the plus four four or plus whatever country code um, you're in at the minute. Um, at the beginning of the mobile number, which means that that doesn't happen. Um, the other things to note are the job price. Let me just scroll across. Uh, where are we? Job price needs to be, the, the cell needs to be set as numbers. Sorry, the row needs to be set as numbers. It's a column, isn't it? Um, and lastly, the dates need to be set as year, 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 month, month, date, date. Um, it needs to be like that because it's a universal date format that's used across the board um, and that's how they'll come up correctly in the system when you've already got jobs scheduled or previous jobs that you're importing.